it's going to be very, very close to um, its predetermined, pre-designed landing site in Inner Mongolia. Yeah. It does look... Stop, in the camera. You know, that Sizwang banner is very close to my home, uh, home city. Three to five days for the, uh, for the vehicle. During the, this whole process, we have to keep a mid-course correction. Mm. Great, so from the voice of... Near side of the moon, this time, soil samples have been collected from the far side of the moon, mm. the first time in humanity's history. We're expecting a landing anytime soon. So We're watching the descent of the returner. <laughs> it's landed. You can hear applause from the ground controlling command center as people watch this with breath. And that is mm. the first one from the far side, the second time for China. And we we'll look forward to learning more about those samples. It could take time. We can see individuals on foot, um, an individual on foot making his way to the v yeah. back to Beijing. Um, it, it'll be a while before the cargo is up. But that greatly depends on the density of the sample itself. So that is the reason, although it is also... Judging by just the surface and the outside of the um, return cap, <laughs> we'll be hearing a statement from the director of the China National Space Administration, <laughs> assessing the status of the returner.